And on this Memorial Day, Travel Rush has millions of people in the air and also on the roads now as a mad dash for home begins. Many facing cancellations, though, and delays over the weekend, which, of course, is causing a ripple effect tonight nationwide. ABC's Morgan Norwood explains. With 39 million taking to the skies this Memorial Day weekend, air travel is now at pre-pandemic levels, triggering flight delays and thousands of cancellations since Friday. I'm here until I can see what's going on. I came here for my grandbaby's graduation. And I didn't expect to get stuck whatsoever. Delta Airlines blaming bad weather and air traffic control action. Just kind of have an adventure after being uh, home for quite some time with the pandemic and all the restrictions. TSA is beefing up its workforce to keep pace, screening about 2 million passengers a day pre-pandemic numbers. We've increased the use of overtime. Uh, we're also allowing officers that are in a part-time status to convert to full-time. The road's expensive too. The national average for a gallon of regular is at $4.62, and experts say prices could go even higher throughout the summer. It upsets me as it does a lot of people, but I think people, you know, after COVID and not being able to get out, I think we're willing to deal with it. And it's not just gas and flights. Experts say the cost of hotels could also skyrocket this summer, making for an expensive travel season. I'm Morgan Norwood, ABC News, Los Angeles.